So this is a really good question and I'm happy to dive into that. So what is the difference between polycystic ovaries that we're seeing on ultrasound versus polycystic ovarian syndrome? And first I just want to say that this is like the worst name for anything ever because nobody actually has cysts with polycystic appearing ovaries. It's really the appearance of multiple small follicles. Um, so it should be multifollicular or polyfollicular syndrome, but I wasn't there when they named it. So polycystic ovarian morphology or just the appearance of polycystic ovaries on ultrasound just means that you have lots of follicles sometimes it means that they're kind of arranged around the outer part of the ovary and I'll show a picture of that in a second but you don't have any of the metabolic signs that are associated with polycystic ovarian syndrome because polycystic ovarian syndrome is a metabolic disorder that comes with a lot more than just the appearance of the polycystic ovary so this is a normal ovary with several follicles, but this is a polycystic ovary with tons of follicles. So polycystic ovaries alone are actually more common than polycystic ovarian syndrome and can be found in up to a third of people of reproductive age. Whereas the syndrome is only present in about 12 to 18% of reproductive age people with ovaries. So in order for a PCOS diagnosis, you need two out of three criteria. One being that polycystic ovary appearance on ultrasound, but two being elevated androgens, either by symptoms, so facial hair growth, chest hair, temporal balding or alopecia, or seeing those higher level of androgens like testosterone on blood work. And then the third would be irregular periods or irregular ovulation or no ovulation. The difference is really important because polycystic ovaries just themselves without any of the metabolic syndrome does not cause any issues for someone. However, PCOS may cause both infertility and long-term health effects that are really important for you to know about. Hope that clears some stuff up.